And so that's how to deal with Bernoulli's equation. Like I said, this will be summed up in a handout that's going to be posted on Blackboard later on. Okay? Um, but it really helps to understand where you're going with Bernoulli's equation, okay? And how to, what assumptions you can make and can't make about the problem. Because there are questions um, that you'll come across in past exams and in this exam that will require you to work out what, how Bernoulli, Bernoulli's equation applies to that particular problem, okay? And there will be points attributed for getting Bernoulli's equation right, okay? So, laminar flow. Can you guys at the back shut up, please? Could you shut up, please, at the back there? Okay, right. Laminar flow. We covered laminar flow first thing in the, in the fluid section, okay? Laminar flow is where you've got layers of adjacent flow that's fl sliding over each other, and it's all nice and orderly, and we can deal with it analytically, okay? Streamlines are straight, streamlines are particles of fluid, and essentially they're moving in a straight line, and you have a nice velocity profile uh, where the flow in the centre of the pipe is the fastest and the flow at the edge of the pipe is virtually stationary. Okay? The example of that would be, say, honey falling off a spoon. Okay? If you took a spoonful of honey and then let it pour, you get essentially what's known as laminar flow, nice and orderly. Okay? And we know it's laminar flow because we can say that the Reynolds number, if that's less than 2,000, we can make the assumption that we're dealing with laminar flow. Okay? Reynolds number, we've got the equation for Reynolds number, um, one, uh, sorry, rho CD upon uh, viscosity. I'll cover that in a second. And if that's less than 2,000, we know we're dealing with laminar flow. And so the flow rate, when we're dealing with laminar flow, we derive these equations in the lectures, okay? Um, we've got the flow rate here, which is pi over this term here, we know is viscosity. We've got a loss term, okay? Uh, over the length, okay, and uh, the radius. And you can rearrange that to, to find the pressure drop so that delta PL term in Bernoulli's equation when you've got laminar flow is this term here. And this form, this equation here, okay, this fo the form of this equation, this is given in the exam, okay, that's on your formula sheet. You'll see that on the back page of your notes as well, which is essentially the same formula sheet, okay. That's given in the exam. So you've got the pressure drop for a laminar flow. And obviously, you can get the flow rate, okay, just by rearranging that equation. It's the same equation, okay? Just have to rearrange it, manipulate it to get the volumetric flow rate. 